so I'm really excited today. I'm going to be doing my first haul video. Basically, it's um, going to be all about when I went to Oxford Street the other day with my sister. Um, I got a little bit carried away and bought a little bit of stuff, so I'll just sort of let you know what I got. Um, the first thing I want to talk about is, obviously, Selfridges! It was my first time ever going in Selfridges, and I have to say, oh my god, it was amazing. I feel like I just want to get a job in there now, but, you know, I've got my own job, so I'm to keep that. But what I got was a MAC palette. Can you believe it? This is my first time ever getting MAC makeup. I am like obsessed with this stuff. Literally, I've like seen so many YouTubers, you know, so many people are like, oh yeah, I've got MAC makeup. It's the best thing ever. I'm like, it's too expensive, can't afford it. So I thought, why not treat myself? So I have this one. I got um, a palette which you can put like your own um, eyeshadows into. And so obviously I got the four palette, which at the moment only has two in but that's fine next month hopefully when i get paid i will fill these two up the two that i got i can't remember what they're called so i'm just going to pop them out were um retro spec which is that one which is actually probably my favorite it's like a sort of like shimmery kind of whitish sort of color and then also sumptuous olive which again looks really really good on my eyes i'm not wearing the sumptuous olive on my eyes today but i am wearing the um retrospect one Ooh, that one and with um, some other eyeshadows and stuff as well but no i just oh i'm obsessed with this thing i've literally worn it every day since i bought it and it is like the best thing in the world a <sighs> L- little bit late getting on the bandwagon with whole mac makeup and stuff but i'm there now so i'm well happy so that's what i got from suffrages um, while i was in suffrages as well one of the girls on the counter said to me to go and check out the food hall because um apparently it's amazing and she was right it is amazing and i got a little bit carried away and bought a few things i found these these are like little meringues like so cute seriously i don't know if you can see them but i've got um lemon i think that's strawberry and raspberry flavored which i haven't eaten yet but they look very very tasty so hopefully they will be tasty then i found these which i see amelia liana if any of you follow her talk about like all the time so i'm gonna give these a try so these are the hello panda biscuits with chocolate flavor filling so yes thanks absolutely starving as well so i might have one in a moment who knows <laughs> and then also i found these which just i'm just obsessed with chocolate at the moment i don't even know but it's called yam yam and it says creamy chocolate flavored dip biscuit snack so again a bit of a chocoholic so yeah love that that is brilliant so that's it for sort of selfridges but while i was in london i went to h&m which i just had to do it i bought this necklace which i'm sure you can see which was about 6.99 7.99 something like that which i'm just loving i've been thinking about getting a chunky necklace for a while and i just this is perfect so i really really like that but while i was in there as well they have some makeup which i didn't actually know that h&m did but i think these are brilliant so let me show you what i got right basically first one i got was this one which i haven't even opened yet this is the nudes eyeshadow by h&m those are all different colors but i like this one so let me just open that so you guys can have a little look if it will open oh god it's stuck well it was 3.99 as well which isn't a bad price much cheaper than the mac one but i'm glad about the mac one but oh god here we go here it comes but yeah so these are the ones and they look really really lovely see at the moment i can't afford a naked palette so this is kind of like my pretend naked palette I'm happy though, I'm going to try these out. I think the middle one at the moment looks like it's probably going to be my favourite, but I like that. So I got that. While I was there as well, they have a beauty blender, which they call a makeup sponge, but it's basically the same. This one. one ninety nine. hello, yes thanks. So I've got one of those, just in case my one's dirty or whatever. And then I found this, which is really, really good, because I'm just making my makeup brushes collection a bit bigger. And um, this is basically a double-ended brush, and it's got this end I'm quite interested in. This is kind of like the... Um, oh, they've got... A a special name but i don't know what they're called but it's kind of like the one that has the point on it and then just a normal sort of brush you know on that end but that's really really good and again two pound 99 so you can't go wrong um next place i went was the disney shop oh, I love the disney shop. and um there was so much in there that i literally could have had everything but i settled for something that was on offer it's all nicely wrapped up so i'll just open it up but i'm quite a big fan of mickey mouse which the bag is brilliant and i've got jumpers and t-shirts and all that sort of stuff mickey mouse on and then i don't know if you can see him but my boyfriend bought me this a while back and that's little mickey how cute is he <laughs> but um basically they had this mickey cup how cool is this on offer from six pounds to two pounds 99 yes thanks so i got that which is brilliant which i will have some milk in love my milk so that's absolutely brilliant and then the last place i went to was lush 
Now, I know I could have gone to Lush, you know, in the normal hometown, that sort of thing. But it was the sort of, you know, I don't know if it's the flagship shop, but it's the London shop in Oxford Street. So I was well happy. And while I was in there, I bought um, my boyfriend's mum her birthday present, which was a beautiful shower gel and like soap sort of like um, little gift bag type thing, which was really, really lovely. And then I had to get a new one of these. These are, I'm sure you guys have heard of these. I'm sure you use them, but oh, it smells so good. This is the Comforter Bubble Bath Slice, which I'll show you. I've got quite a good one actually. Quite a good size and stuff. But I just love this stuff. I literally, I feel like I could eat it, but obviously I won't. That might make you go. <laughs> but this is it. It just smells so delicious. Like, oh, I don't even know like what is in it properly. Whoop, nearly dropped it. That would not be good. But it is literally the best thing ever. I'm sure it tells you what's in it, but it doesn't say anything on there. But, oh, I could just smell it all day long. Oh, it's so good. But no that was my first ever haul so i hope you guys like it um obviously if you did again give me a thumbs up and then if you want to subscribe that read them well to me i've got about 11 subscribers which i'm so grateful for so thank you for subscribing um obviously i want to get more but you know it's up to you guys and stuff but thank you for watching and i'll see you again later bye